Yo, what's up guys? It's me, Thomas, and today we are going to be making a realistic vault in Fortnite Creative. With the new update, they have brought the ID, the, the cards, the key cards from BR. And yes, sorry I haven't uploaded for a while. I have been doing some really busy stuff. But yeah, let's get straight into it. Okay, so first what you want to do is you, you're going to go to the galleries, right? And then go to top secrets. Uh, go to your property and you want to go down to the bottom to get these two vault pieces Once you've got them put them into your slots, but then don't stop you need to go into the shark gallery and look for This piece right here for me. It's right here so also next what we're gonna need is a item spawner a sentry we are also going to need one of these bombs right here uh, where is it right here explosive device and then you need to get a conditional button now this is crucial for what we're gonna need for the thing so what next what we need to do is to get any key cards on um, today I'm going to use the uh, I'm gonna use the rig key card because I think that one looks the best with the vault that we're making so let's get straight into it let's get the key card it looks like this in game it looks really awesome so what we're gonna need is to take this floor piece I've already made what you want to do is make your room or if you're gonna use the new agency prefab or the flotilla prefab you're gonna need to get you can use that now what you want to do is to get to your vault part you want to place two out then get the walls the indestructible walls that you got into your inventory place two of them like so like this so it's like two on the sides the, the, on the left and the right and then there's one at the back then you need to place two on the side so now what we want to do is to grab the open vault part the open vault part and you want to make it so it's open and put it so it's uh, one grid snap out from the walls like this not so it's um, out fully flush but so it's like that okay so now what you want to do is take that this but make sure it's the right way like this and make it so it's flush with the wall like so like so yeah right okay so next what you want to do is go back in there you want to look for the art deco gallery and where is it uh, right here so once you got into here you need to look for the art deco prop gallery click this and you need to get this vault open part with the hole in it right here you want to take that and put this so it's you need to rotate it like that around so now it looks like that now once you're done with that you want to take this uh, explosive device go into the um, settings and when you and you need to change these settings right here so you need to change the health to indestructible blast radius to zero oh no to 0 0.25 player health damage to zero next you need to make this to 5000 damage to indestructible buildings yes not back you need to be make it zero because if you have it on it will blast you back when you open the vault and you don't want that so next what you want to do is change a play audio vfx off visible during games to no um next what you want to do is change play audio to no then you can do it to any channel that's free but you need to make for me i'm going to put it onto channel one so you want to take this make it smaller put it in the center of your vault like so like that okay uh, I'm also gonna make a little entrance like so um, okay right so we've got that now for our sentry we're gonna need to take our sentry that I forgot to get mine so we need to take it put it in the corner 
but also I've got one special thing guys you need to um don't resize it guys you need to make take this put it so it's kind of like in the wall like so for the income for the button I need to put that almost flush inside I did it wrong guys so, but this is what you need to do so you put this onto the floor but make sure it's not in the ground or it all the way into the wall so you need to take this make sure it doesn't go all the way in sometimes you can just put it on group 32 I think that might help yep yeah, like group 32 on this now you want to go into the files and put it all you need to change is use color for uh, hologram to yes uh, turn on what's this yes yeah, so you need to disable after use yes uh, and only key right next you need to do um, a visible during game yes you need to make the show key card direction on um, make that keep that on yes uh, and you need to activate no when tr uh -huh. oh, oh yep yeah, sorry when activated transmit on channel one so it's the same as the bomb so now you want to go back to your sentry make this I'm gonna make it like a drum gun like Midas uh, I want to make it drum gun and then health back up to 300 shield to 100 no respawn time range uh, keep that at 10 accuracy we need to put it as dead shot you need to put it as spawn on game start to yes when eliminated transmit on channel 2 or whatever channel you have 3 same with that as well so you want to take this and you want to place two of these right here so this wait delete this one just go into one of these what you want to do is turn this to off visible during games to off time before first on to never and this one to never as well so you want to go down and make this spawn at I when receiving from channel 2 so it's when eliminated transmit on channel 2 so it's the same as this you want to copy this put it like this you want to take this as well I forgot to put it in here but what you want to do is you put this card into there there might have been a si but you can change one of these as well because that would help as well so you can go down here as well I think there's a setting I might have lost let's have a look there should be a hologram kind of thing uh... oh. shoot I oh, need to cancel that Right, I don't know what's going on, but the, I think I'm missing a setting, I don't know. Make it as default. Yeah, I don't know what's going on, guys. Oh, no. This is what... I, you need to make it visible during game. You need to make it hologram only. Go back over to this. You need to get the drum... A blue drum gun and you also need to get in the consumables the same one so I think I've, I've got the rig key card so I'm gonna put the rig key card into there okay and we need the Midas drum gun or the normal drum gun the blue drum gun as you normally call it into there now what you need to do is you want to take these two item spawners and put them on top of there so that should be done like that so you've almost finished now we just need to start the game and get it but also what we're gonna need to do is to get a weapon to kill them so what I'm gonna use is a primal shotgun 
and you also, if you're gonna test this and you already got guns on your islands, just go and start the game and get a gun. But as I haven't, what you wanna, if you're gonna do the same as me, just change these to instant. Do that, and also get some medium ammo and some shotgun shells and put these on here so you have things like that. Okay, so now what you wanna do is just start the game. Okay, so when the start, so you've got the thing there. So now just kill the boss. Right, so now we just killed him. We've got the minus drum gun, or just the normal drum gun. Sorry, I keep doing it. Now you've got the read key card. So now when you just hold it out, you've got it like this. So now when you open it, you've got the vault and you can put chests in here as well. Or you can make the vault bigger as whatever you like. So yeah. That is the end of the video guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. Um, oh yeah, I'm s again I'm sorry for uploading, I was really busy. But hopefully soon I'll be able to upload some more things. I'm thinking of doing some more creative things instead of BR things, but I don't know. Season 7 is coming out soon, so I'll do a video on the Battle Pass and what stuff there is. So yeah, if you enjoyed this guys, hopefully you enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe if, this found, if you found this very useful. I know I did, but yeah, thanks for watching guys. Bye!